duckling. Why is it crying, Mintu? Because it thinks it's an ugly duckling. <laughs> it's not a duck, but a swan. You mean it will grow up into a handsome swan? Once a duck and a drake were eagerly waiting for their eggs to hatch. Soon it was time to rejoice. The eggs finally hatched, and out came five little ducklings, one by one. But one of them was very different from the rest of them. You are so different than the rest of us. But don't worry, you will be good when you grow up. But other ducks were not so kind and affectionate as the mama duck. All the other ducks and ducklings made fun of the young one. Na 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 na! You are so ugly. You are not one of us. <laughs> Look at you! You are so ugly. Nobody wanted to play with the young duckling. He had no friends or family. He was all lonely and sad. He saw his reflection in the water and assumed, "Perhaps I may be really ugly. I don't want to see my reflection ever again." Tired of all the bullying and rejections, the ugly duckling left his home and walked into the woods. Tired and lonely, and when all hope was about to be lost, a kind woodcutter took pity on the ugly duckling and took him home. The woodcutter took good care of the ugly duckling. The ugly duckling was happy to find a cozy and warm home. The ugly duckling grew bigger and bigger day after day, with strong wings and legs. One day, it flew to a nearby pond and wandered around the edge of the pond. The ugly duckling saw a wedge of swans playing in the pond and admired them. What beauty and grace! The swans noticed the curious ugly duckling. Hi, want to play with us? The ugly duckling was quite surprised. It was long since anybody had been so kind to him. But me? I would love to. I like your beautiful wings. What are you called? The swan burst into <laughs> laughter and said, <laughs> "Same as what they call you." Me? You mean an ugly duckling? <laughs> Who called you ugly? You're a beautiful and handsome swan. What? Me a handsome swan? The ugly duckling peeped down to see his reflection. Yes, he had grown into a beautiful and handsome swan, and he had never even been a duck at all. What a fool I had been to believe others all these days! Come join us. We would be glad to have you as our friend. The ugly duckling was finally happy and free. He realized that he was just different than the rest of the ducks. Hmm, being so.